So I thought we'd talk a little bit about sometimes when stuff doesn't work in ZBrush. So for example, when you're decimating a character. Here I have a character and I'm looking at his head, which has 2.6 million polygons and I have layers on it. If I go to Z plugin and I open up the decimation master here and hit pre-process current, that process is fine, it took 32 seconds. I go back to here and I hit decimate current. I'm expecting my 2.6 million polygons to go down. And instead a message flashes up far too quickly to read and nothing happens. We're still stuck at 2.6. And no matter what I choose here, it's just not decimating. What's actually happening there, I'll go into solo mode. Uh, I have a, a shortcut for that, is control one. What's actually happening is I have some of it hidden. So if you hide your character, I'll, if this isn't working, if your decimation master isn't working, just hold down control and shift and click on your canvas to bring everything back. And now the next time you do it, the processing that you did before will still work. So you can just immediately go and hit decimate current and that will cut it down to whatever amount of polygons you, you need, which is fine. Another thing that can happen is that you may have your model here and decide you want to turn on dynamic and you turn it on and nothing happens. And it doesn't matter how many times you change the smooth subdivision, it's not gonna update. What's happening there is that you've got again, hidden part of your model. I'll go back into solo mode. You can see we've hidden something here. Again, control shift will default to your select rect, which means you can just control shift and tap on your canvas and that will bring everything back. And now you'll see that your dynamic will work perfectly. So as usual, hope these little tips help and don't forget to like, comment or subscribe. Or if you have any other suggestions for tutorials, please do let me know. All right, bye.